This morning in family time, it is time to get outside and have some fun with the entire family. There is plenty going on at Southwick Zoo in Menden. Joining us now to tell us all about the attractions and what's new, it's Executive Director Betsy Brewer. Good morning. Good morning. How are you today? Hey, I'm great. I'm happy to chat with you. My my kids, they love your zoo so much. You have plenty going on, a lot of unique attractions. Let's talk first about the uh, the deer forest. I love that one. You can really get up close and personal with the animals. Absolutely. And we've tried to inspire people to get close to animals. So, you know, part of our mission and our vision is to get people connected to animals and in the deer forest is a great place to do it. We have Eurasian fallow deer and people can walk in and buy a little bit of feed and feed the deer and walk around. It's a 35 acre deer park and I think it's probably one of our if not the most highest rated attraction that we have at the zoo people really enjoy it yeah and hard to compete because we're going to talk about a lot of the other highlights you have including um, the bird shows which we can learn a lot more about the animals macaws in particular you've actually been able to raise money for the macaw project tell us about it absolutely and a lot of our programs or most all of our programs and shows are conservation and education based so what we do is we always try to tie a conservation project to our programs. So when you come to our bird show area, you may see a training session or you may see a free flight uh, part of the show. But also what we do is we have these little sun conyers that will fly out from the stage and collect dollar bills. And with the dollar bills that we collect, we give them to the Blue Throated Macaw Project in Bolivia and they build nest boxes. So we've had many nest boxes over the year and fledglings that have gone on to live their lives in the Bolivian rainforest. So we're really excited about that. That's one of our conservation projects. So yeah. That's really a lot of fun. Lots more to get to as well. You have the backdrop behind you. The rhino exhibit is something really spectacular. Absolutely, and we are the only zoo in New England with white rhinos. Mm -hmm. They're pretty impressive, you know, at two tons a piece. So their names are Thelma and Louise, and I think everybody <laughs> likes them. And uh, we also have uh, rhino encounters where we do an educational encounter where you can actually touch the rhinos. And out of all the large animals here at Southwick Zoo, they're the ones that are probably the calmest and the mellowest. Mm -hmm. They don't have a lot of natural predators out in the wild, of course, poachers. But so they're pretty calm animals, and we've raised a lot of money for rhino conservation. Certainly. Uh, and for the sake of time, too, I know you have a, a lot of great rides, a pony rides, which my son has done, camel rides. You have a, a, a lot of great other attractions, too. And then summer camp will be here before you know it. So there's so much for the young kids out there. Oh, absolutely. And the rides are just so much fun. We have a Skyfari Sky Ride that goes about 20 to 30 feet around part of the zoo. So you can see about one third of the zoo. We are on 200 acres, so it's a full day of fun. Mm -hmm. And then our Woodland Express train ride goes through a 50 acre habitat and it's beautiful. The train ride is definitely going to be done on our next visit for sure, Betsy. Don't forget they have these beautiful tigers as well. You, you, you can't miss. Betsy, thank you so much for taking a couple moments with us this morning. Absolutely. Thanks for having me. This segment was brought to you by Southwick Zoo. To learn more about their hours and all the animals that you can visit, head on over to roadshow.com.